Safe driving advocates see the way it as the way of the future. You get in your car, buckle up, and then blow. New breathalyzer technology in cars could stop drunk driving. Virginia is the first state to test out the system. 13 News Now reporter Ali Weatherton shows us how it works. It's new technology that can potentially save lives. It looks like a small air vent in a car, but it measures how much alcohol is actually in a driver's breath. And this could soon become a safety feature in new cars come 2025. It really gives people the opportunity to think about what they're doing before they get behind the wheel. James River Transportation in Norfolk is the first company in Virginia to test this system out. Manager Jason Hall says the company already submitted almost 30,000 breath samples. The technology is very cool. Uh, it's it's you know kind of blends in again with everything in the vehicle. Um, you know, it, it's almost undetected if you're unless you're really looking for it. When a driver gets in, they have to blow into these two sensors. According to the DMV, the tiny hole has an infrared light to analyze the breath molecules of the driver. If their blood alcohol concentration is above 0.08 percent, the car won't move. That's great. It keeps our roads safer, my kids safer. Everybody in, you know, that's traveling is, is going to be much safer with this technology because you can't have these, you know, alcohol related uh, issues on the roads. And DMV officials say if you have a teenage driver like Hall, you can actually set the car to not drive if it detects any alcohol. Me personally, peace of mind to know that, you know, even if my children decided to go out and and not use the best judgment that, uh, you know, at least this way they remain safe. In Norfolk, Allie Weatherton, 13 News Now.